Oh, it's, it's been wonderful. Uh, this is quite unusual for our field to have a prize like this uh, and to have such attention uh, for the kind of multidisciplinary work uh, that we do. So it's really quite amazing. It's, it's quite an amazing uh, accelerant for the work that we do for integrating different fields uh, and looking at planetary health, looking at uh, human health and looking at how we can live uh, and thrive on the planet uh, rather than the vast amount of problems that we're going to be having in the next few decades. So, so we're planning to invest the uh, money into a, a rapid food transitions lab. Uh, what many people don't understand is that even if we make the entire energy system transition, we put in all the wind turbines, we put in all the solar panels, the food system on its own is enough to push us beyond 1.5 and even 2 degrees of warming. The food system is driving most of the biodiversity loss in the world, it's driving most of the aquatic pollution in the world, it drives a large proportion of the air pollution, the list goes on and on and on. So how do we figure out ways in which we can make a food system that works for us and works for the planet? And also how can we make it robust to the climate punches that we would be feeling in terms of the droughts, in terms of the flooding on, on the areas that we produce food in? Well, it's been wonderful interacting with people here because everybody is working on different aspects of the same uh, issues and what that gives you is a different insight into how you might be able to figure out these futures, uh, these visions for the future that might result in, in a better world overall for many people. I mean, already at the moment around the world, people are, are struggling. And so if we can think about a future where people are thriving, uh, then then that's, that's magic, you know, and, and working with other people uh, to look at the science behind that and how you might path, make a path for those futures is really, really important and interesting. Yeah, I, yeah, I love the performance. Yeah, it was really, really good. I, it, I think um, it's often quite hard to do art around environmental change uh, because it, it can often feel quite big, it can quite feel quite uh, full on for people. But I think the performance did an amazing job of, of, of being both lively and, uh, you know, and, and interactive in the audience. And so, yeah, I, I really loved it. And uh, I thought that it's, it's just a huge thanks to the, to the jury uh, and to Johan Rochum for chairing it and bringing this all together uh, and to Frontiers for uh, sponsoring the prize. So, um, yeah, I'm just hugely grateful.